what, what the lady's talking about. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, family? As seen in the thumbnail, there is a picture going around of Barack Obama and Melania Trump exchanging a healthy, tender smile. The big question is, what did he say to her? Now, they were attending Barbara Bush's funeral on Saturday when someone actually recorded that picture. That picture was actually a recording and somebody uh, shot a still of it for a picture. Now, Melania Trump, if you've been following her, she never, ever, ever looks happy. She always looks depressed, especially when she's around Donald Trump. Every now and then, you know, you'll see her like on a picture with her son or, you know, video or whatever. She looks, you know, pretty happy. But anytime she's around Donald Trump, her head is dropped. You can tell her mannerisms. There's been many times they've been in public and she refused to hold hands with him. She don't hug him. She's not affectionate toward him like a woman is toward a man. Now, this dude is the president of the United States. You would think that his woman would really, really be all over him. You know, like, hey, you know, I love you, but damn, boy, you president. Now, damn, I got the president. You know, you would think that she'd be like, whoa, oh well, yeah, but not Donald Trump. Because Donald Trump is trash. And everybody knows it. But nobody knows it more than Melania Trump. Because she, unfortunately, has to sleep next to that scum. What a horrible life. What a horrible life. Melania has never looked so happy. Unfortunately, her happiness was short-lived because she had to let Barack go because Barack is already married to Michelle. And she had to go and you know, back to her lonely life in the big old White House with Cheeto Man. Everybody wants to know what Barack said to her, though. What do y'all think he said? Leave it in the comments. I want to know. What do you think? Try not to be vulgar. They could have been also comparing inaugural crowds. <laughs> it's ironic that this picture circulating of two people having a conversation seem to be enjoying their conversation and smiling. You know, they seem happy. And they were sitting <laughs> at a funeral uh, of Bar Barbara Bush, the former first lady of all people. But she did seem happy. But I'm going to talk to my ladies for a moment. Ladies, if it were you and you had to be with Donald Trump, I mean, you got that. Okay, I, I can see somebody trying to play the game for a minute, try to get in his pockets and run with the money, but she got to, she got to, she got to roll with it for like four years at least. Five years if you count when he was running. So, I mean, that's like a, that's like a prison sentence, right? Could you do it? I need to know. I need to honestly know. Could you do it? And if you were as unhappy as Melania is in the relationship, knowing that she's married to the president and no, uh, I guess no one expects her to divorce him or leave him while he's in the White House, that would be too much of a scandal. That would be an international scandal. Could you do it? Could you stay? Could you stay the course? and be with the orange man. Donald Trump is a filthy human being. He looks like his skin stinks. His breath also seems, that's a gimmick. His breath, I'm, I'm sure his breath stinks. He sit around and, and eat fast food and chips and drink soda. 
and eat Twinkies and watermelon and chicken all day long. That's what they were just watching television just all day long. Something else a rock could have told him is, hey, me and Michelle are going bowling later on. You want to go? <laughs> Looking at that picture was the first time I saw Melania smile and it didn't look forced. I wonder what happened when she got home. She probably kicked him in the nuts when he tried to grab her by the pussy. No more talk. What the haters talking about?